It was a busy Memorial Day on the softball diamonds as well with a trio of local teams all taking aim at a trip to state. We start in 2A, Newman in the Elite, in the elite Eight for the fourth straight season, battling Chicago Hope scoreless until the fourth. Comets with a couple on for Garrett Wolfe. He delivers the base hit to left field. It goes under the outfielder's glove. Daniel Kelly scores. Newman up 1-0. Later in the fourth, Comets up two. Garrett Matznick grounds to short. They throw it away at first base, allowing two more runs to score. It's 4-0. Bottom five, Newman gets some insurance on another hope mistake. The throw from short is off the mark. Chase Decker scores. Fifth run of the game, it's 5-2. Bottom six, Comets manufacture another run. The ground out to third scores Oswalt to make it 6-2. And that was more than enough for Evan Bushman. He goes the distance, getting the strikeout here to end it. Comets celebrate winning their second straight super sectional. Six to two, your final score. We knew they'd become hot and heavy out in the beginning because they wanted revenge from last year. And we just we just kept their cool. We kept how we play our game. And it was it's just awesome just winning, especially 1A and then going up 2A and winning. It's awesome. It just means everything. I mean, a lot of people don't get to do this even once. Even like winning a regional is tough. So it just means a lot. I was just really comfortable throughout the whole game. I mean, I obviously don't throw the hardest, so they're obviously going to hit off me. But just knowing through five that they weren't hitting off me, just more confidence built up. And I just I knew our field was going to make the plays and we'd be fine. It's special at 2A this year, too. We got one at 1A last year. Um, I'm not sure people really thought we could do it at 2A, and it means a lot for us. We're, we're so young, too, with these guys. Sometimes I don't think they know any better. Uh, and today was one of those days. Newman will take on Moroa Forsyth Friday at 4 p.m. in the 2A state semifinals.